This right here is a Goss gun, and today I'm going to show you how to make one. Let's take a look at Newton's cradle. When an impact is made, the steel balls transfer energy through each other at the speed of sound. This causes the last ball in line to push away. If we apply this principle using magnets to create the force, we can get a much similar effect without strings attached. The name Gauss gun comes from Carl Frederick Gauss, who formulated the mathematics used in magnetic accelerators, which is essentially what we're going to be creating here. All we need to do is get a small rail that a ball bearing will easily roll on. Then we want to get a neodymium magnet and tape it and secure it to that rail. Once we have that secured, all we need to do is load up the steel bearings. If we add a ball to the other end, the magnetic force will eject the end ball on the other side. Here it is from a different angle. All right, let's give it some target practice with my Rainer action figure. I stand corrected. Bullseye. Now if you like today's Scientific Tuesday, then you might also like these videos right here. Go ahead and check them out. And if you have any questions or comments for me, go ahead and hit me up on Facebook. The link's down there in the description bar. See you next week. Thank you.